Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you love dance and gymnastics like me, there's a slight chance that you play like dance or dance moms or whatever, but I do awards. So yes, two days ago I made this little second place dance moms plaque and today I'm gonna show you guys how to make this. Now it's really simple. It's easy and a fun craft to do. So the first thing you're going to need to do is you're going to need to cut out two rectangular or whatever shape you want pieces of cardboard so it's stiff. I wouldn't use just one plain piece of paper because that can rip. Cardboard, on the other hand, it's more difficult to rip. So basically, I have these two squares. I cut these with a box knife. And if you are going to use something like a box knife, make sure that a parent does that. My mom was near me when I did that. So, but I would rather use scissors. Just scissors are very hard to cut through cardboard with. But if you really need them, you can sharpen the blade by cutting through tin foil. So yeah. Now what you're gonna need, you're gonna need something to draw with, something to color them with. I have these little oil pastel markers. Yeah, that's what I'm using. Then you're going to need, let me go get it. And you'll also need pieces of paper, about four pieces, I think. Yeah, four pieces. But every single square takes two pieces of paper. So I have two of them, so two plus two equals four, if you didn't know math. And then you're also gonna need tape. So first thing you're gonna do, you're going to grab a single piece of paper like this, and you're going to blaze that flat down, and you're gonna put your piece of cardboard directly in the center, and I said that, and I didn't say this, but the cardboard piece doesn't have to be perfectly cut. It can be like all funky or whatever. Each and every single homemade plaque is unique in its own way. Now, so basically what you're gonna do, you're gonna fold over one side, piece of tape, fold over the other side, piece of tape. And then you're basically gonna wrap it like a present. You're going to make like a triangle tip kind of like this. I'm just gonna fold that over like that. And then I'm gonna put a piece of tape. I'm gonna fold this side over, this side over, and then like that. So then it's gonna look like this. But I'm going to do another piece of paper because when you press down, you can see the like the bend stuff in cardboard. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna repeat that process. So if you weren't paying attention, put it down, fold over one side, tape it, fold over the other side, tape it, form into triangle like so, fold, Tape, fold, tape. So now this is what it should look like. The edges on this one are a little bit better, but that's okay. Every single plaque is unique. Now what I did is I got a dark blue marker. Oh wait, that was it for the like how to actually make the plaque. Now I have a dark blue marker and I'm just going to color the edge. But first I'm going to make a square. Like so, like a little square. I'm just gonna color it in. Now it doesn't have to, and I just realized I used a different color. <laughs> Silly me, but it's okay. 
every single plaque is different and has a different look. When you think about it, not any plaque is the same. Anyway, so yeah, you're just gonna color it like so. And I'm sure you don't wanna see me color it, so once I'm done coloring it, I will show you guys. Okay, so I finished it. I didn't make mine perfect. Yours doesn't have to be perfect either. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find my black. Took me a second there, but I found it. And I'm just going to copy everything on this one, but first instead of second. So I want to just put it right here for reference. I put... Okay, then what I do with the colored pencil, I just write a little yellow star in the corner. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Okay, ready? Spot the difference. Did you see it? But yeah, so I have first and second place. So yeah, first and second, now I'm going to make third place. Okay, so I have the third one done. I have all of them done now. So, third place, second place, the original one, and first place. So now I have the third place plaque. If you get third place, then you get this. I have the first place plaque. If you get first place, you get this. And I have the second place plaque. And if you get second place, you get this. So now let me say, these aren't, these could be for solos, but for solos, I'm probably not going to use the first place plaque. I'm not going to use that one. Because I actually have a crown, which I use as the first place trophy. But for second place, I'm going to use that. And for third place, I'm going to use that. But the only reason why I made a first place one is for group dances, duets, trios, like all of that stuff. Because not one person can share a crown. So we have plaques. And once I win a trophy, there'll be a trophy. So, yeah. But that was the video on how to make these fake Dance Moms plaques. And, yes, you could, instead of making it all homemade, like, with your handwriting or whatever, you can probably search online to find Dance Moms, like, plaques and then just, like, glue it on. But for some reason, oops, he's hair in my mouth. But for some reason, I couldn't find it, like, anywhere. And I searched for at least, like, 15 minutes on Google, and I could not find it. So I just decided to give up and do my own drawings. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next week for a really cool video. I've been posting once a week for, like, three weeks in a row, I think, so. So, yeah, probably going to be posting at least one time a week now, hopefully. I say that a lot, but then I never do. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys next week for a gymnastics video. So, yeah.
haven't done a gymnastics video in a long time, but next week is going to be a gymnastics video, and I might post a second video. So, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Thanks for watching. Oh, wait a second. Before we go, like this video, subscribe, and click the bell. Yeah. Okay. Well, goodbye. Boop.